Today we're going to review part number HM11143814. This is the Hopkins plug-in vehicle specific wiring harness with the four pole trailer connector. Now this is a custom fit part number. It's designed to fit the Hyundai Elantra Coupe starting in 2014. This is a plug-in simple custom wiring kit which will utilize the factory connectors on your vehicle to hook to and that will allow you to have a four-way at the back of your vehicle to plug in your trailer wiring harness to to get lights on your trailer. There are no cutting or splicing required and basically these connectors are just like your factory connectors. Basically these will plug into the back of your tail lights. <clears throat> now the four pole trailer connector, it does use the corrosion resistant terminals. Also has a nice dust cover that when it's not being used you can put on over the terminals to help protect it from any damage or elements. Now basically everything for this part number is included which is all shown here on the table. It would include this powered converter module with the wiring and the four-way. It includes this 14 gauge extra length of 14 gauge wire which would be needed to run to your battery. I'll show you how to do that in a minute. Comes with this fuse assembly. Take the cap off. The included 15 amp fuse is made to go in there. Comes with a ground screw so when you're grounding the white wire. And it comes with the zip ties to take up any slack of the wires if you need to. And it comes with a nice packet of dielectric grease which would be used when you put them on the terminals here when you plug in your, in your trailer. <clears throat> So basically this is a powered converter module which will adapt your vehicle's wiring system to work with the trailer. Basically this will safeguard the vehicle's wiring system by pulling power for your trailer lights directly from the vehicle's battery, not through the existing wires on the car, so it protects those. Now you do need to run an extra wire to the battery, this wire here, using this extra length of uh, wire, you run this to the battery to power this module. So basically what you would do is when you go to install this, you go to the rear of the car and these connectors right here on these wiring will connect to the back of your tail lights. So when you disconnect your tail lights, these would plug into them. And basically what you would do is this section here or this portion of the connectors with the yellow wire in it, this would be for the driver's side. So you'll go to your driver's side tail light and behind the tail lights so unconnect them, connect this into it. And then you'll go to the passenger side and this extra length of green wire will run across the car onto the passenger side and again these connectors will plug into the connectors behind your tail lights on the passenger side. Now the white wire right here that has an eyelet on the end this will need to be tightened down to a good ground so if there's a screw on your car that will give you a good clean ground directly to metal or you can use drill a hole and use this grounding screw to help get you a good clean ground. And the other wire that needs to be connected is this red wire, as I had mentioned, with the butt connector on the end. What you would do is take your end of this 14 gauge wire, put it into there, run this wire all the way to the front, and then get your other end of wire, and you would connect it to this fuse assembly, and then take the eyelet on the other end of this fuse assembly, connect it to your battery, and then put your 15 amp fuse in there, put the cover over it, and then that way you'll have a fused system that will protect the wiring. <clears throat> Now on this uh, converter module, the specs on it, the maximum amperage on this is for stop or turn lights would be three amps per circuit maximum, and on the tail lights would be six amps. But basically that's a way to show you how to connect this wiring harness to your vehicle. Pretty simple to do. The only thing that would take a little more time would be running this wire to the front of your vehicle. But that should do it for the review on part number HM11143814 the Hopkins plug-in vehicle specific wiring harness with the four pole trailer connector.